Can you introduce yourself? Yes, I am Mercedes Bernal. I'm the owner of Meroma. Um, where do you live? I live in Colonia Roma. In Mexico City. In Mexico City, yes. And where did you grow up? In Mexico City. What did your parents do? My dad was an airline pilot and my mom was in finance. Cool. What was your first real job? Cooking in a kitchen. Yeah? That's cool. What did you want to be when you were a kid? I would I would be a lawyer for a Really? Second. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't pan out. No. <laughs> Um, what's your favorite city you've ever traveled to? Um, Paris, probably. What does a typical day at work look like for you? Um, I get into the restaurant at 11 and work both services until like midnight. <laughs> so I pretty much work the whole day. The whole day. <laughs> Coffee or tea? Coffee. Yes. Favorite neighborhood in Mexico City? My neighborhood, Roma Norte. Best part about owning a restaurant? Pues you get to sit down and drink and eat whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite smell in the kitchen? Um, all of them. Probably garlic. <laughs> like, yeah. Awesome. What spice makes everything better? What spice makes everything better? Cumin. I love cumin. Mm. What meal do you love to make at home? Uh, pasta. What was your favorite meal growing up? Favorite meal growing up? Probably lasagna. Mm. What's your comfort food? A Lebanese food. Mm. Is there good Lebanese food in Mexico City? A lot. Oh, yeah, nice. it's a huge community. Um, favorite fruit? Mangoes. Vegetable? Broccoli. Interesting. <laughs> what, do you, <laughs> what do you never travel without? What do I never travel without? I don't really care about anything. My, yeah, no, my computer. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a language you've always wanted to learn? French. Tried and failed. <laughs> a place you have always wanted to go? Portugal. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Who would you take with you? Uh, probably Rodney, my husband, or my dog. <laughs> <laughs> um, if you could travel in time, where would you go? Probably Paris in the 1800s. <laughs> <laughs> so fun. If you could have coffee with anyone in history, who would it be? Ah, I don't know. This is difficult. I know this is the hardest question. Yeah. <laughs> este, I want to say a chef, but it's not true. Um, probably Hemingway. Like, oh, wow. what would you order in the restaurant? Uh, I was thinking of just talking about Cuba, but a mojito. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, what are your hobbies? My hobbies, aside from cooking, right? <laughs> obviously. Um, I have no hobbies aside from cooking. Uh, it's funny, all these brilliant women have no hobbies. No, it's like, they're they're like so intense, huh? Because <laughs> uh, I really do love cinema. Okay, cool. That's What's something you've always wanted to try? In food? In life. Always wanted to try. I've always wanted to do skydiving. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, favorite season of the year? Fall. Who, what was the last book you read? The last book I read is probably going to be embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was not a cooking book. The, okay. last, the last book I bought was Estela, the book of Estela in, in oh, the, yeah, the yeah. New York City restaurant. Yeah. That's the last book I cool. got. Um, who is the last person who texted you? My best friend, Maria. Nice. She sends me six memes a day. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good best friend. <laughs> what is the one word you think describes you? Damn. Probably intense. <laughs> <laughs> what is the one word you think your friends would use to describe you? Probably intense. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's your favorite word in Spanish? My favorite word in Spanish? Ay. Wow, What does that mean? It's a, an herb, like a quelite, kind of like 
purslane or oh, okay. it just grows wild. Cool. Um, <laughs> what never fails to make you laugh? My dog, Lucas. <laughs> <laughs> He's really cute. <laughs> What's your favorite thing about Wild Trains Travelers? Because they're very adventurous, for sure. <laughs> Where do you want Wild Trains to go next? Oh. South America? Where in South America? Uh, well, I've always wanted to go to Peru, so if you go there, yeah. I'll go with you. <laughs> <laughs> what does the rest of your day look like today? Today? Because I'll teach a class, and then I'll go back to a restaurant, and hopefully find somebody to have a drink there. <laughs> <laughs>